Welcome back, everyone, to Hearts of Iron 4, in which we're playing as America Do Soul. Of course, we have the Travel Legions DLC, and this is the world. We're looking pretty good. We actually broke through Venezuela very easily after we ended the last episode, even though it was kind of cranky and whatnot. Um, it's probably because due to the change to combat width and my lack of understanding about combat width at the time of this recording. Um, but, yeah, combat width 25, so 40 doesn't really work. That's my fault. I should really apologize for that, so I'm sorry about that. We're complaining because I didn't realize it was only 25 combat width. This is 60 combat width. Uh, come with, it's, it's all over the place. Regardless, Venezuela broke very easily. Um, but, yeah, this looks like a giant mess. Because it is a giant mess. Um, you have the Fourth International Fight on the German Empire of Congress, and the Italian League is there. And most of Asia is in with the Germans, but we don't care. Mercosul is looking pretty good, and I hate that Argentina is with Americans, but whatever. We're going to do our best to snake up through Central America and see what we can do. Um, we have a lot of green. Doesn't mean it's going to last that way. We just declared war on these guys. We've lost a couple thousand. Is what it is. Um, and we also invest in industrialization of Brazil. Um, our economy is shattered by the Wall Street crash and ensuing depression. For the welfare and security of our people, we must rebuild the economy and diversify it. Which we've done to a lot of places already. Um, but... It is what it is, I guess. Hey, look at that. Our navy is looking well. It's looking alright. Any 44 carrier cruiser, huh? That'd be pretty good. Uh, that should be even better, too. Hey, just look at that. That's a decent carrier hull. Uh, that means we need carrier planes, though. Like any 44 cruiser hulls? Well, we're not going to have enough naval XP for all this. Light cruiser batteries, anti air, fire control, radar, level 4, and level 4. 33 is okay. Yeah, we're gonna keep that for now. Get rid of that. That'll be okay. And do that too. We're gonna need a lot of steel. Yeah, this has gone very easily now. Um, anything up? Any upgrades here? No. Upgrades for you? Not really. Are you level five yet? No. Specialist organization. Which organization wouldn't be too bad. Uh, yeah. Army organization looks pretty good to me. Well, it doesn't pop up here. That is what it is. Uh, where are you guys at? There. Let's have one giant fight like this. She insisted it encryption. Very cool. And I won't get on the line as fast as I can, basically. Or just capitulate them. 46,000 extra infantry equipment. Nice. So I don't understand why this was so easy compared to Venezuela, which was so difficult until like we did it off screen. Like It makes no sense to me. Um, you'll probably do that. We'll need the Marines to invade. And these are all actually all Marine divisions. Very nice. Uh, can you do that? Probably not. Uh, can you go to Panama like this? You might be able to do that, maybe. In the meantime, we're going to train. Oh, I think we're going to war whenever we actually want to. Go to war with Panama and Li Liberia. So we'll see. Um, max that out. We're still making a nuclear reactor, which is great. Anything else we have? We need more naval XP. Uh, and we're going to integrate Meta. I don't understand why this is only 20 political power. When I played it was Argentina, it was like 75. I don't understand the giant difference in political power costs. It makes no sense to me. But we're doing the Depart Department of Propaganda, which is pretty good. Department of Logistica. Uh, South America may be our home, but it's nonetheless a ruthless continent for regular armies to fight on. To alleviate this issue, it would be beneficial to found a branch of the armed forces dedicated solely to prepare management and distribution of logistics. Oh, oil processing, not bad. Uh, it is 1945, it's almost 1946, which is kind of insane thing about we're playing this late, but whatever. Uh, what else? Ooh, we want to call it La Libertad. Promote resource extraction. That'd be good. Our industry has been blessed with abundant natural resources. To promote greater economic growth and independence, we shall invest in modern extraction equipment for our industries. Establish Kaloi Factory. Escalating tensions across the world have made it difficult to import bicycles and parts from Europe and North America. With their abundant access to rubber and steel, perhaps we should establish our own bicycle factory and incorporate their use into the military and war production. The fires of war are spreading faster on the globe. Should they come to our lands, we must be able to rapidly switch our industries from producing cars and toasters to tanks and bombs. Invest in ports. We may create problems supply in the needs of our economy, domestically, to such an extent that we can look to, to exports once more as a means of promoting economic growth to do so. We should need to invest in the nation's major ports. That would be great. In Piaui. Hara? Nice. Um, logistics, perhaps? Yes. Let's do this too. 
Because you're split in two. Alright. Honestly, just do that, that's fine. And they'll heal up a little bit. That'd be fine. I love suicide kills. Yummy, yummy. Um, there we go, too. Let's see. Cruiser hulls. Yeah. A lot of upgrade. Light cruisers, aircraft. That's fine. Anti air. Anti sub. Can we do that there? Can we do. Anti air here. Torpedoes. There we go. Yeah, we're really lacking a lot of steel, aren't we? Woof! Because right now, this is what? Military settlements. Neglected state. And it's very hot, but what do you expect? Oh! Well, that's not good. Come on. Do we have to fight all these guys? Oh, we're fighting the United States too. Why? Bro. Ski. Well, I guess, I guess since we're here. Well, we'll see what we can do. Just take the Panama Canal. That'll be good. I don't think we're going to make it all the way to America. America's very tough. Especially in 1946, my god. Engage it low priority. Um, yeah. I'll just poop them out anyways for now. Just in case. Uh, wow, they're all politically connected, huh? We'll see. I don't want to go to war with you guys. Lucky Venezuela. I don't understand why, what the point of that would be. Well, if that's the case, I guess we can go back and do this one. Provoke Argentina. If you're going to do this again, please go ahead. Um, God. God dang it, America. We can do some convoy raiding here. Is that possible? Our ships are just going to get the crap blown out of them so fast, so easily. It's not funny. Um, at least we've got the Panama Canal for now. Well, we don't really need more rubber, do we? No, fuel's looking pretty good, too. Uh, there we go, maybe? Please don't beat us. Uh-oh. Can I find some convoys around here? Yeah. Hey, sunken American convoy. Hey, sunken American destroyer. Feeling okay about it? Please don't die. Oh, yeah, we find stuff here? Oh, we sunk another American destroyer. That's right, America. We sunk your destroyers. What do you What do you want from us now? Now the small task force until they just bring in the giant navy and just murder us all. What do we have here? Ace pilot promoted. Oh, that's nice. Wait, is it is this disabled or something? Oh, okay, whatever. The light cruiser. Yeah, can you sink that one? No, we lost a ship. Are you kidding me, bro? I know our ships suck, but let's do better than that, please. 
Naval Doctrine. We're not done with the Naval Doctrine yet. There we go. Yeah. Good repair. Fast repairs. Fast repairs. Good. This coastal defense ship. Oh, God. Not very bueno, I should say. We're not going to do this anyways. Oh, he's sick too. How oh, great. Good job getting sick. Money. Still repairing. Three days left. Maracaibo. Alrighty. Oh, another convoy sunk. I'm just waiting until our ships get completely blown up. It'll be a little more aggressive. Bureau finding's good. A little more extraction would be nice, especially for our steel. And that the convoy sunk. Nice. Look at all the damage we did to them. Actually, 13,000, huh? Alright. Provoke Argentina. Oh, hello. Do both areas. I'm not gonna split them in two, though. Uh, I mean, I guess we could separate the subs for now. Oh, they're in battle. Oh crap, they're here. If I do it like that, then. Um, or you can do it like this, maybe. The faster we can move, the better. More torpedo attack would be decent. Uh oh. Oh wow, 40 convoys. Holy crap. We're all over the place here. Oh, are those Chinese ships? No, the Burmese. The Burmese are here. There you go. That actually gives us more than enough time to be ready for these guys, too. Just in case. Oh, we don't even have the same time. Well, that's dumb of us. So, what happened here? Lost a convoy. Convoy. Hey, we lost three destroyers, which is not good, but they're early destroyers versus 34 enemy ships. Not bad. Nimitz has got nothing on us. Nice. Very nice. Level 5 is pretty good. Out. We're actually doing very well down with Argentina. Um, they have a lot of divisions, but we're not sure where they're at. G6 is good. Uh, we're finally engaging the naval war. Nice. Nice. You go home and repair. Fine and sink every single combo they've got. Argentina takes a bait. Argentina appears to be preparing their own forces for an attack against us, following a recent provocation um, uh, along the border. Though do they know they're falling into our traps and will have the opportunity to crush them and they'll suffer the international condemnation for war? Yeah. Very nice too. Don't the air doctrine. Just one turn Brazil into a superpower, that's all. Okay, I'm getting there. I just don't let him move yet. We're doing way better than I thought we would. Oh crap, they're over here too. Like animals, bugs. American tanks, huh? Ooh. 
great. Are you still fighting? Ah. Hey, Costa Rica's done too. Good. Nicaragua. Uh oh. It's not bad. An acre? Uh. We could blow the Suez or the Panama Canal. Oh, we don't have an annex, so we can't get cores on Argentina. Which sucks. Oh, there's American Navy. Oh god. That's our missing ports. It looks really bad, but there's not really much that we can do about it right now. Blueprint stealing. Uh, war production. Ah, uh, so the Netherlands I've been called into this conflict too. It's fine, whatever. Yeah, we'll see which is good. Looking good so far. Superiority, naval invasion planning, special forces capacity multiplier, tiny bit more organization, special forces attack, or marine commandos. Excellent for any coastal province, which is pretty strong. More breakthroughs is pretty good. We're not really using Amtrak, which really wouldn't be bad to use, but that's armor, we could get pierced anyways. Let's get the special forces for everybody. Capacity multiplier, more organization, special forces attack. More defense is nice, invasion capacity, supply grace for marines. Hey, that's a nice job. We're pretty much going to be doing this until we can't be successful, so. Must be completely out of aluminum. That's not ideal. Well, it goes Burma. Looking better too. Cleaning him up. I like it. Oh, what the heck happened down here? War production. Uh, accept factory. Are they naval invading us? That's a lot of divisions here too. Did we just beat them up? Oh yeah. Very nice. And I'll deal with them down south too. And go in. Good. Take this stack of 24 because they keep reinforcing down here. I don't necessarily want to do this. You're weaker though. You're going to go here.
mosquito. For now. There you go. Good. Let the Americans die. Mm. Yeah, uh, it doesn't really matter at this point. Air support, sure. Very surprised at how well we've done. It's level 6 already, too. Oh, look at that. They're trying to take us here, too. Interesting. Hey, nuclear bombs. That's pretty nice. Probably would need a big old strategic plane to do that. <laughs> and or a large airframe. Um, experimental stuff? Or... I guess fabric of the national demotors. Motor vehicles are complex machines that have therefore cost a great deal of money to import. This is the potential to hold back economic growth in the long run. The best way of preventing this is by developing our own domestically produced vehicles. That should help us with the steel, should help us with the chromium, which actually is kind of rare for us to not have enough chromium, but that's fine. Would the Marines be strong enough to take out Nicaragua? Kind of saw that one coming. Engaging low. Hey, you learned something here, huh? A Lancer. Good reveal chance. Alright, we'll do that one. Just start chucking them like crazy. You become a sea wolf, maybe eventually. I don't know. How are we doing down here? Very nice. And at least let's take up Nicaragua next. Yeah, about three weeks left. That's not bad. Mm -hmm. Domestic design scores. So we best create and produce our own models and plane designs, so as other countries cannot be deemed trustworthy of either designing or producing airplanes fit for pilots. We were this last time repair naval yards. Ooh, ship repair speed. Plus 25%. Even the most robust ships with the most efficient crews will eventually need repairs before returning to active duty. We should invest in our naval repair yards to ensure the process is as rapid as possible. chance, yes. Looking pretty good in the south. I love nuclear bombs. There we go. How's Europe looking for a good war? Well, still looking pretty lopsided here. Not much has really changed. China's looking split. British Empire's looking thick. Pretty normal. Wow. We delivered a quarter million casualties. It's not bad. Not bad whatsoever. Managuia. Nice. Firefighting drills. Save our ships a little bit, maybe. Fantastic. Oh, we just straight up annex them. I don't think we core them, though. That'd be kind of nice. It's a nice little teal color of ours now. And we added 16 more ships. They're garbage and completely, but that's okay. That's a nice teal color that we got here. Don't mind this ugly Argentine color over here, but whatever. 
I don't think it's going to add us. Oh, oh, look at all this. Okay, so let's spawn all these. Integration. No, no progress. Completed America to Seoul. Oh. Is it because we capitulated them? America to Seoul. Yeah. One culture. Sure. Mongolia joined the Firth International. Hell. Imperial Civil War in Canada, too, huh? Well, then. Imperialist Canada versus Canada. All right then. I'm glad the Canadians are having troubles. Yeah, this makes us very strong. Yeah, no, you can become easily a world power by doing this. Those are public Spain, huh? Just kill them off there; you'll be fine. Yeah, it's gonna be a pain in the butt to do. Excavation. Steel's looking way better. Look at that. That's fantastic. Integrate the canal. Hey, this, this episode's way better than the last one. Last one we just struggled so much. Oh, this goes to Gibraltar, too. Nice. Tons of convoys. Even a few uh, screens from the good old US of A. Go bye bye. Yes. I don't even know that. Go up there. This is annoying. Mobile force. Carrier design. More repair speed. It's just straight up more repair speed. Of course, Imperialist Canada. Of course we'll help you. Break commander, surprise attacks, retreat chance. Uh, there you go. Hello? Please do not leave him alive. That would be a giant mistake. Expand the repair yards are good. And we have enough aluminum too, that's fantastic. Convert aircraft carriers. Uh, destroy purchase and subs, with the world becoming increasingly unstable. We need to expand our naval power projecting capabilities. Luckily for us, some of our major navies may be willing to part with some of their older vessels. Formosa. Hey, look at the Dutch. Oh, wow. Nice. Oh, there's American Navy. That's what we don't like to see. Of course, then again, it's the AI, so they don't really adapt their building too much. Oh, they actually are attacking us. Look. They were attacking us. We weren't able to build a ship yet, were we? Go and repair. Why not? Come on. Well, how many more days do we got left for these guys? Yeah, it's not bad. Overall, much is in here. We're doing actually very well now. I don't understand why we struggle so much. I guess I guess I do understand. It's uh, it's all the uh, combo with stuff. But we're looking fantastic. I think this was actually a successful campaign. I apologize for the how negative I got in the last episode. It's very frustrating when things don't work out well. We sunk a battleship. Nice. But this is awesome. Look at that. America do sol. Or do sul. So, the German rack's looking pretty good. German Empire. We're looking pretty good. We're in Central America. We're pushing up. And America's... They've actually lost a little bit of Montana. Look at that. Huh. But hey, if you enjoyed the video, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my discount link. Discount link. Discord link in the description below. Oh, we're over here too. Look at that. And I'll see you tomorrow in another campaign. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.